Boris Gatanbalvas has spent the last decade leading the fight to save the critically endangered Philippine crocodile, the rarest crocodile in the world. One of the biggest challenges she faces is the animal's negative image. Some people view them as dangerous and crocodiles are killed. So Tess works to increase public acceptance of crocodiles through awareness campaigns, community workshops and education. As a community organizer, I was able to change their negative attitude towards the Philippine crocodile. I was able to gain their confidence, which led to their involvement and active participation, not only in the protection and conservation of the species, but also its natural habitat. Her approach also offers practical solutions. Four crocodile sanctuaries have been set up and are managed by the local communities. Trees have been replanted to prevent erosion of riverbanks. Crocodile habitat has been restored and nests rebuilt. Crocodiles that have been given a head start in captivity have also been released. And Tessie's work is paying off. The Philippine crocodile is now better understood and respected. Killings have declined and the population has increased from just 12 in 2001 to over 100 today. <laughs>